I don't think I've ever been as off put by a character design or just image in general from One Piece. And I know you guys saw it in the title. It's a, it's a One Piece live action trailer just dropped. Everybody's going wild. Everybody's going crazy. One Piece is gonna go live action. Calm the fuck down. Okay, everybody knows that live action animes are renowned to be dog shit. But I don't know, man. After seeing Buggy, bro, oh, holy shit. We might have to, we might have to reevaluate how, how we, how we look at this movie. We might have to look at this movie like a fucking horror movie. Like, if we, if we, if we shift our, our view on the live action One Piece trailer and, and just whole series in general into a horror movie, it might be a fucking masterpiece. Especially after seeing this shit. This, this, these images right here is fucking popping up everywhere. Absolutely everywhere. And it's terrifying the shit out of me. And just knowing Buggy's powers? Oh no, that's 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 like that's literally horror movie material right there. Just fucking change the whole theme of the One Piece live action into a horror spin-off at this point. Cause I think that would do well. I, I believe I believe that would do well. At least it's original and it's not following One Piece in the way it's supposed to. So people aren't really gonna care. Because it's different, so we're gonna have a different view on it, you know? But anyways, um, it being a live action in general is already a horror, a uh, horror movie in of, in of itself. So, uh, we're gonna see how it is. But I'm open-minded, because they do look like they are putting a lot of effort. The casting is actually quite, quite good. And Oda is directly working on the series with, with the directors and all that stuff, so... In Oda we trust, you know, that's what that's what we're supposed to say. In Oda we trust, but let's let's check this out. I don't need I think it's in English. I don't I don't need that. I don't need that. Like this set, scenery already amazing. I'm not gonna pause for first period. We're just gonna watch, take in whatever cinematic music they got, the scenery, the characters. Hopefully not shit my pants in the process. Let's see. And then we'll go over it later. The music already fits so well. Ooh. So, I'm setting out to follow my dreams. I'm not gonna lie, the sets do look like like it's obvious that they're set, but it might not be about that. Looks amazing. Like Italy, is that Greece? And I think together we'd make a pretty good team. Dude, that that shit's so perfect. I said I wasn't gonna pause, but like, how can I not admire that, bro? That is like a perfect fucking cast, man. Dude, he looks so good, bro. He looks so good, Zoro. Ooh, yes, sir. Legendary manga. Dude, that actually looks okay. I'm not gonna lie, that's pretty solid CGI. It's not. It's it's obvious CGI, but it's not the worst. And considering it's One Piece, you really can't get mad at it. That's solid. No, 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 man. I'm sorry. I said I wasn't going to pause, but they got the detail on... Bro. I'm shitting my pants during this fucking live action. I'm already shitting my pants because One Piece is getting a live action. It's a jump scare in of itself. It's a fucking... That's a horror theme. A horror recipe. But this, this is... This is... This is next level, bro. Replace Pennywise with this. I, I, I would be more terrified of this. Oh, God. He eats kids. I bet he eats kids. And knowing his powers, bro, imagine seeing a floating buggy head. And that's live action. That's what he would look like. Take it. That's what he would look like. Oh, my God. I'm sensing a little bit of tension amongst the crew. Not <laughs> I feel like that's a bit out of character for Luffy, but we can, we'll we see. Because it's live action, you know? You can't be too goofy or it's just going to take you out of it. Usopp, bro. Usopp 2? Perfect cast, man. That was perfect. Look at Usopp, bro. That's amazing. I love that. Oh my god. This is. All great fighters call out their finishing moves. No, they don't. I love it. I, I wonder if they're gonna play. Oh my god, okay. I like how, I like that little detail. I like that little detail. I like that. Okay, I'll talk a little bit, then we're gonna go in. We're gonna pause a little bit. But my main thoughts on this, based on what I watched, is 
the the sets sometimes look like it's obvious that they're sets like it, it doesn't blend well into trying to make it into a live action but depending on how they play it it might end up being good pretty good because it does look like a solid live action like i can't lie some of the sceneries especially is actually gorgeous they're not sets and you can tell and it just it just seems like it fits fucking perfectly but it seems like they're going for a more cinematic real vibe with the one piece live action they're not trying to bring that cartoony type of goofiness to the live action which is good because i don't think it would translate well into <clears throat> what the fuck i don't think it would translate well into a live action setting but with the way that they ended it off there like the fucking like all great fighters call out their finishing moves and then zora's just like no they don't that part i like that because that means they're toying with the line of like you know fiction because that's that's what every anime does you know you they yell out their move but in real life you just look goofy as fuck and luffy's supposed to be goofy so playing into that but immersing that in a like live action setting i think that's that's actually genius that's genius okay let's just go through this again because this part especially they're taking a different route for this a hundred percent taking a different route the way they're doing it they might set it up differently just just so it translate a bit better because it might be weird going through flashbacks this and that but we're gonna have to see because i don't even know if there's a kid cast for for luffy in this but we saw Shanks. We saw Shanks. I think we saw Shanks when the CGI uh, sea monster came in. But dude, look at that. It looks like a set. Like it looks like you're, you you went to watch a play, but it looks really high fucking quality. And they you can tell they put effort into it. That lo that looks amazing. This specifically like jumped out at me as like it's a set, but together we'd make a pretty good team. But Zoro just looks so sick, man. Zoro just looks so sick. Like. That looks amazing, bro. And the sword plays actually seems like it might be good because he's not always in like three sword style. They might play a little bit down on the three sword style just because it will be awkward as shit uh, doing that for Zoro in live action. But this is Shanks. I think this is Shanks. So I'm interested how they're going to play out. I'm interested to see. I know this is this is just I this is fucking ridiculous. I can't even believe this, man. Like even here. They're trying to play into to Luffy's like carefree goofiness, but they're not trying to play it into it too much where it's trying to it's trying too hard to bring like the cartoon vibe into a real life setting. So I heard this is eight eight episodes too. It actually looks like it could be really good. If you just if you're just in there for the trip, if you're not trying to compare it. Finishing moves. No, they don't. I like it. Honestly, I like that. Final thoughts. I would be lying if I said I wasn't skeptical because it's a live action. I have to be skeptical. And some sets look a bit off and you can tell. But depending on how you shift your mindset of it, don't you, I don't think you should go into this One Piece live action with the thought that it's going to be completely faithful to the anime. Because if, if you are thinking that, you're just having unrealistic uh, expectations. And if they were completely faithful, faithful it was going to look absolutely dog shit, okay? It was going to look fucking horrible but if they go a little bit original route to try and and mesh it well into a live action setting then it could be good you just have to like have an open mind you'd like have to like i would even say forget that it it is it's an adaption from a source material like from an an the anime or the manga because it is going to be different but i will say honestly the cast is pretty perfect i'm not gonna lie i'm i might i i'm get, i'm definitely gonna react to this i'm definitely gonna react to this let me know what you guys think let me know comment down below like if you agree with me or just fucking leave me alone or some shit i don't know man do what you need to do you know do all that do all that anyways i'll see you guys in the next one